Hello everyone. This is Jeff Buner, and today I'm going to share with you a sales tip that came to me as a young man and vaulted my earnings from $60,000 a year to over a million dollars a year. That year, I came across the writings of Sultan Musa of Mali, one of the richest men to ever walk the earth. In his writings is a formula. Now, at first glance, you're going to think you've heard this before, that you know what I'm about to say. Don't make that mistake. You've only heard half the formula. The magic is in the second half. Now, the first half of the formula goes like this. Use your imagination to see the result you want and then pretend that it's already happened. Pretend that things are right now the way you want them to be until you can actually feel what it's like to have it that way, to have what you want. Now, here comes the second half of the formula. Sultan Musa of Mali knew all about the subconscious mind. He didn't call it that. He called it the veiled mind. But he was talking about the exact same thing. He wrote that the veiled mind is the mechanism that controls your life. Whatever your veiled mind believes is true for you, it will make true in your physical world over time. And it has the absolute power to do it. Don't doubt me on this. If you believe this, it brings us to an important question. If your subconscious mind makes true everything that it believes to be true about you over time, who's telling it what to believe? The answer, you are. You have been. You're telling your subconscious mind what to believe about you and every aspect of your life right now in a special language that has nothing to do with the words that roll out of your mouth. Your subconscious mind hears, believes, and obeys only one language, and that's the language of feelings. Feelings. It's always listening to your feelings. It takes your feelings at face value and believes them. It then expertly orchestrates situations into your life that keep your life aligned with your predominant feelings. That's how it works. So let me ask you a question. If that's true, how are you feeling about your ability to walk away from any presentation with the sale? How are you feeling about your ability to double your sales team's revenue this year? Because however you're feeling, positive or negative, that's the way it's going to be. And you can take that to the bank. And you don't have to know how your subconscious mind is going to do it. You just have to do your part. Use your imagination, pretend that things are right now exactly the way you'd like them to be until you can feel what it's like to have it that way. Now, you can use this tip to improve any aspect of your life, finances, health, fitness, relationships, anything. As you do it, you'll be flooding your subconscious mind with feelings that match the life you want. And you can trust me, it will hear those new ultra-positive feelings and believe them. If you do this for even a few minutes every day, you'll see the evidence that it works. Your subconscious mind will make tiny adjustments to your circumstances to bring your life into alignment with your new feelings. Now, to you, these adjustments are just going to look like weird coincidences. But now you know that these coincidences are the adjustments your subconscious mind is making as a direct result of you following the formula. 
So here it is again, the formula. Your veiled mind or subconscious mind believes your feelings and will orchestrate situations and circumstances into your life to keep it congruent with your predominant feelings. Change your feelings, change your life.